Welcome to Mind Journey Chronicles, Unlocking Inner Exploration. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to delve deep into a topic that affects millions of people worldwide, Dax depression. We'll not only discuss what it is and its symptoms, but also provide you with 10 proven tips to help you overcome it. So let's get started. What is Dax depression? Dax depression is a relatively new term in the world of mental health, and it stands for Digital Anxiety and Exhaustion Depression. In today's hyper-connected world, our constant exposure to digital devices and social media can lead to feelings of anxiety and exhaustion. This, in turn, can contribute to a unique form of depression known as Dax depression. Causes of Dax depression The causes of Dax depression are rooted in our modern, technology-driven lifestyles. Excessive screen time, social media usage, information overload, and the pressure to keep up with a digitalized world can all contribute to this condition. Symptoms of Dax Depression Now that we've touched upon what Dax Depression is, let's dive into its symptoms. Recognizing these signs is crucial for early intervention and effective management. Wander Social Isolation One of the most common symptoms is social isolation. Individuals with Dax Depression often withdraw from in-person social interactions, preferring the digital realm. Constant digital distraction. Another prominent symptom is a constant need for digital distraction. This can manifest as a compulsive urge to check your phone, social media notifications, or emails, even in inappropriate situations. Three, poor sleep patterns. Dax depression can also disrupt sleep patterns. Excessive screen time before bedtime can lead to sleep disturbances, making it hard to get a good night's rest. Farther decreased productivity. Decreased productivity is another common symptom. Excessive digital engagement can lead to procrastination, difficulty focusing, and reduced work or academic performance. Five, anxiety and mood swings. Anxiety and mood swings are often associated with Dax depression. The constant exposure to curated online personas can lead to self-comparisons, causing anxiety and even depression. 10 Tips to Overcome Dax Depression Now that we have a better understanding of Dax depression and its symptoms, let's move on to the most important part, how to overcome it. We'll discuss 10 proven tips to help you regain control of your digital life and improve your mental well-being. Tip 1. Set Digital Boundaries The first tip is to set digital boundaries. Create specific times during the day when you allow yourself to use digital devices and stick to them. Tip 2. Digital Detox Days Consider incorporating digital detox days into your routine. These days, stay away from screens and focus on offline activities. Tip 3. Limit social media engagement. Limit your social media engagement. Unfollow accounts that make you feel inadequate or anxious and reduce your overall time spent on these platforms. Tip 4. Practice mindfulness. Mindfulness can be incredibly helpful in managing Dax depression. Engage in mindfulness techniques to stay present and reduce digital distractions. Tip 5. Prioritize real-life relationships. Make a conscious effort to prioritize real-life relationships. Spend time with family and friends in person, fostering deep, meaningful connections. Tip 6. Screen-free bedtime routine. To improve your sleep patterns, establish a screen-free bedtime routine. Avoid screens for at least an hour before going to bed. Tip 7. Find offline hobbies. Find offline hobbies that you genuinely enjoy. These can be a great way to divert your attention from screens and nurture your interests. Tip 8. Seek professional help. If Dax depression symptoms persist or worsen, don't hesitate to seek professional help. Therapists and counselors can provide tailored strategies to cope with this condition. Tip 9. Join support groups. Consider joining support groups or communities of people dealing with Dax depression. Sharing experiences and strategies can be immensely helpful. Tip 10. Practice gratitude. Lastly, practice gratitude. Focus on the positive aspects of your life and appreciate the non-digital elements that bring you joy and fulfillment. The impact of Dax depression. Dax depression isn't just a personal struggle. It can have significant societal impacts. In this section, we'll explore how this digital anxiety and exhaustion depression affects us and our communities. Impact on relationships. One of the most noticeable impacts of Dax depression is on relationships. The constant digital distractions can lead to disconnects in personal relationships. Couples may find themselves glued to their screens during quality time, leading to misunderstandings and emotional distance. Impact on academic and professional life. 
In academic and professional settings, DAX depression can lead to decreased productivity and performance. Students may struggle to concentrate on their studies, while employees may find it hard to focus on their tasks. The need for instant digital gratification can also lead to procrastination, making it challenging to meet deadlines and achieve goals. Impact on Mental Health Services DAX depression has created an increased demand for mental health services. Therapists and counselors are seeing more cases of individuals seeking help for digital anxiety and exhaustion depression. This surge in demand highlights the importance of addressing this issue on a broader scale. Economic Impact The economic impact of DAX depression is also noteworthy. Lost productivity and increased healthcare costs related to mental health treatment can place a significant burden on both individuals and society as a whole. Coping Strategies now that we've discussed the impact of DAX depression, let's dive into practical coping strategies that can help you or a loved one struggling with this condition. Undevelop a personalized digital diet. One effective strategy is to develop a personalized digital diet. This involves assessing your digital consumption and making conscious choices about which digital activities are essential and which are not. Do digital minimalism. Digital minimalism is another approach. It's the practice of intentionally using digital technology to add value to your life while minimizing distractions and mindless consumption. 3. Offline Activities Engaging in offline activities is vital. Activities like reading physical books, taking nature walks, or pursuing creative hobbies can offer an escape from the digital world and provide a sense of fulfillment. Time Management Techniques Utilize time management techniques to structure your digital usage. Techniques like the Pomodoro Method, which involves focused work intervals with short breaks, can help improve productivity and reduce digital distractions. With mindfulness and Meditation Incorporating mindfulness and meditation into your daily routine can significantly benefit your mental health. These practices help you stay present and reduce digital anxiety. Dix Prioritize Physical Health Don't neglect your physical health. Regular exercise and a balanced diet can have a profound impact on your mental well-being and your ability to manage DAX depression. 7. Support Network Host, cultivate a strong support network. Reach out to friends and family for support and open discussions about your digital struggles. Sharing experiences can make you feel less alone in your battle with DAX depression. As to educational resources. Take advantage of educational resources on digital wellness. Books, articles, and courses on the topic can provide valuable insights and strategies for managing your digital life. 9. Set Smart Goals Set smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, time-bound goals for managing your digital life. This will provide a clear roadmap for your journey towards digital balance. 10. Professional Help If your DAX depression symptoms persist or worsen, don't hesitate to seek professional help. A qualified therapist or counselor can tailor strategies to your unique needs. In closing, DAX depression is a real and pressing issue in today's digital world. However, with awareness, understanding, and the implementation of these coping strategies, you can take control of your digital life and improve your mental well-being. Remember that it's okay to take a step back, unplug, and prioritize your mental health. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share it with others who might benefit and don't forget to subscribe for more insightful content. Thank you for joining us today and we'll see you in the next video. Check out our next video and subscribe!